Alberta's premier is defending his government's proposed school curriculum after growing calls the new draft is whitewashing Alberta's history. During a Facebook Live Monday night, Jason Kenney said historical injustices were taught out of context. There are some who would like to teach that Canada is basically a completely unjust or even legitimate settler state um, and that our entire history is one of injustice and genocide. I think that is a terribly distorted, ahistorical view of this amazing country we've built. Some Albertans aren't holding back on what they really think about the new K-6 to plan. The government's proposed curriculum makes our kids' education more colonial, cisgendered, American and whiter. Racism, like religion, is a social fact. It's interesting that the draft seems to devote pages to religion, but not to racism. No black influences on jazz music, no Chinese building railroads. Only residential schools in the U.S. Racism never happened in AB's history. We can't just pick and choose. That has been the history of history education in Canada. This education expert says, while some history of Indigenous and Métis people are included in the draft, there is no mention of residential schools until grade five. In addition, the way it's characterized in grade five, the predominant emphasis is on residential schools in the United States, which I don't have any explanation for why that's the case. We cannot understand society today or how we've come to where we are in society today unless we understand the breadth of experiences that all people living in Canada have had. Adding the delay of learning about residential schools goes against the recommendations made by the Truth and Reconciliation Committee that students start learning about the parts of Canada's darkest history as early as kindergarten. No meaningful discussion of diversity of Alberta or Canadian communities. Um, it's it's really problematic when you think about it from a multicultural and diverse uh, perspective. The new curriculum will be introduced this fall to select schools before it's officially rolled out. You can give your feedback on the draft on the province's website. In Edmonton, Rochelle Sufi, City News.